Hi guys. I have had a number of requests now to show the bio settings that I did on my Asus ROG Strix X570i motherboard alongside my Ryzen 5 3600 to lower the temperatures and get things running fast and smooth. So this is going to be a relatively quick and dirty video just to show you guys what I have changed. I haven't changed a whole lot, but the few things that I have changed have brought my idle temperatures down by about 15 to 20 degrees in a case that does not breathe well, and at the same time brought my benchmarks way, way up. So without further ado, let's get to it. So the first setting that we're going to be dealing with is going to be DOCP. That affects your RAM clocks. You may have noticed when you started it up that your RAM was a lower speed than you thought it should be. And so you just want to set this DOCP and that will set it to what it should be advertised as. Next we're going to change the VDDCR CPU voltage override. First you change the setting above to manual and then this one to 1.30. Next we change the VDDCR SOC voltage, again change above to manual and the number here to 1.20. And then finally we want to change the VDDG CCD voltage control to 1.0. And with all of these successfully changed, we should have the right voltage for a more stock setting on Ryzen 3000 CPUs. Now understandably, stock settings don't always sound great, but trust me when I say you will want to start here because most of these gaming motherboards overclock from the get-go, producing results that are supposed to be faster but often too hot, especially with the Wraith Stealth Cooler, to effectively give you the speeds that you want. As a matter of fact, with these changes of reduced voltage, my performance personally went up by a very large percentage. I would say probably about 20%, um, just spitballing here, but I definitely recommend trying these out. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I hope this will be helpful to some of you. Please, as always, if you like this video or, or if it was helpful in any way, hit that like button, subscribe down below for more videos, and I will see you in the next one.